he's one of the most recognisable players in the AFL, a towering figure in the game. But this is Aaron Sandland's other world. How are you, Al? Getting oh, on all right? Thanks, are you? Getting no on worries. all right today, mate? Yes, yeah, good. Meet the boss of Gecko Contractors, Turf and Landscapers. When football is finished, this is where his new world starts. Look, I think it's a good life balance. Um, the club strongly encourages us to do stuff outside of footy and um, set ourselves up for when you do finally hang up the boots. Why lawn mowing and turf care? Well, it's in the Sanderland's blood. Well, before footy, I worked with Dad for four years as a, a lawn mowing contractor and it's become a family business. Got my brother involved, Dad's involved. So um, to spend time with these guys and um, you know, become part of your job is pretty special. The AFL's tallest player loves nothing better than getting out on the job and chatting with his team, not his footy team, his turf team. And here, the talk is not all about football, and that's the way the boss likes it. Friday spray. Though invariably, it gets back to that crosstown rivalry. We've got a couple of uh, die-hard uh, West Coast supporters here, and. Um, yeah, they know that uh, they've got to become Dockers members if they want to keep their job. <laughs> He's a four-time All-Australian, the best ruckman in the competition. But the big fella knows the clock is ticking. He wants to kick some goals in life after football. Yeah, look, I'm um, closer to the, the finish line than the start line, so I knew, always knew I had to find something outside of footy. And been looking the last couple of years for business to get involved in, and um, this one came up. and sort of match pretty well with Dad and myself and Chad and yeah, we thought we'd give it a crack and see what happens. Michael Thompson, Nine News.